Presenting a man for Uptown TV. You understand? <laughs> what go on, my lovely people? What go on, my lovely people? Big up on yourself. You know, we're there again tonight. Yeah, man, we're there upon the struggle. We're there upon the game. Different settings tonight, people. So you don't know the thing. Go. You know what I say? Yeah, man. I saw we do it more time and you know? we switch up the game. You see me, I say more time we're there. So more time we're there over one different part. Is it? Yeah, man, but I still want settings. So you see it, my people. You don't know what I go on tonight, you know. Muta Baruka. You see it. Cutting edge style. You see it. So you don't know. Get to the self ready. You understand? Yeah, man. You don't know all the things. You see it. So get to the self ready, you know. Yeah, man. Get to the coffee. Get to know Red Bull. Get your head pull. You see me? Yeah, man. Get your matches stickers with Muta Baruka. Say Muta every day. You see me? So you don't know. We give thanks for what go on. Is it on life? We don't know what go on on the cutting edge tonight. So you don't know. You going to see what go on early in the morning. You see it? So we put in the work and do the work. You see it? So you know what go on my people. Just big up on yourself. And you don't know. One thing me have to say my people. Just like the video. So the algorithm can pick it up and it can go where it's supposed to go and reach the ears that it's supposed to reach so you don't know i one of them thing there you see me so big up on yourself big up to all of my loyal subscribers them who never go no way and you see yeah man we improve every day and we are do the thing them so yeah man i one of them thing them people so here we are going man big up on yourself and we definitely we are go Make the thing work tonight. So big up on yourself. You don't know. Yeah, man. I one of them thing there. Make sure you like the video, you know. And share the video to your grandmother, your loved one, your kids, your dog, your, the cat in your yard. Is it? Mad thing, man. First in that truth. Why you ball on the moon? Set them radio ready to listen at the club. club. Listen to music out of South Africa. I guess it's too sure, my dude, you know. I know I will have one where decides to you know, go buy a ticket to go up a New York there. I'll make sure, you know. Yeah, man. Good at your house. Chill on it to be exact. And then the next month, some face. What a thing. Music like music. Come, <laughs> trust me. So you yeah, know. <clears throat> you know, me I look on these bully for things you are going all over the earth and people are saying, but I gotta go protect them from this and gotta protect them from that. Me I look on the cars of war is really I deal with Yahweh, Yahweh, and the, the Palestinians them said them I deal with Allah, Allah, and in other problems we will look upon them and die. They must say Allah, Allah will protect them. Me and the bomb drop in the other, I protect them, you know, and then the bomb drop and kill all of them. And the other guy over the other side, he must say, Yahweh, I will give back him land. When promised them, according to them four or five thousand years ago. And bomb drop and kill them. And then they, 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 they captured them. The hostage, they were them old in Gaza, the, the, the Hamas people, them old. So most of them are American and they are Christian. And they are pleading to them God said, we have call them parents and family members. I say, they are pray to God to bring them home. 
safely. So right now we had three different kind of people a prayer to what them believe or they, them think is three different God or the same God. It could have never been. Because one of them are Baba Parallel and I pray to the next one. We're going to come forward, first break. The different people them I worship. Well, I call it them is one God, but they call it different name. And depending on the situation where them find themselves in, uh, them say God bless them. Or the other people, them is devil. So depending on who is saying what, because of why and when, them things say when them pray, there's something out there that is listening to them. Other than themselves. And then disaster come. Poor people who do have nothing more than the little house. And them really find it hard and a struggle. And rain come and watch them house. Rain come and watch them house and fire accidentally burn down the mouse. Them need help. And no one know they forget them help. And them start to pray again. And pray and pray. And them situation get worse. Another man, rain come and him all stand up straight. Not nothing else. Not at all. Not no watch it. Nobody not dead to him. And him fish pack up and him have one heap of food. And him pray as a give thanks to God. To provide him with all this food, bounty, and all these things. And him is not a sufferer and can afford it. What a dynamics involved in that situation where people who poor and needy, when the so-called acts of God come up on the earth, as most of them feel it, people who spend their life I pray to God. People who spend their life I go to church every Sunday or Saturday, depending on which denomination they belong to. And all through them life, them can't afford things to put on top of them house because it's not leak. And sometimes them can't afford food to put on them plate. But them pray to this thing. All of them like, and they bring up them children for prayer. And just like how them sit down and I hope and I wish, them cause them children to get up and hope and wish that one day life will be better. All them have to do is pray to this something where they don't know about, them never see it, them never hear about it yet. I mean, they never hear yet. What is it that is causing people to do this? What is it that is saying, rain come and watch a poor man house? Most of the time, the poor people feel it when flood come. Because them, some of them are squatter according to the system. And them now have them know what it is unnecessary to combat the storm or to help themselves as it relates to food, clothes, and shelter. But them pray your feet every day. Please, God, 
that food comes from the table. Let me get a work that me can help me pick me to go to school. And so them teach them children for also do the same thing. Prayer. And some people might say, well, I told them I have no faith. But when you start to pray to something that you don't know where that something is, who and what that something is, it's faith you have. You never hear the Bible say faith is sometimes have things old for and evidence of things not seen. It's most faith you have if you have a prayer to something where you don't know, never see yet. But you have to say that will help you in your physical needs. And when you look at the people them out there, we don't go to church. Go out with most craziness. The same thing where you are prayed to got something far. It's got them up and them not going to church and them not praying. Explain that. Explain that. Why is that we look on the TV and we say how much thousands of children dead because the next people drop bomb on them? How much 15,000 children them say gone because people drop bomb on them? And then the people who drop the bomb on them give thanks to them God to overcome the enemy and pity them. Because according to the Bible, not evil the child from the mother's breast must touch them, touch them against the wall. We're going to take a break again and come forward. Yes, my people. So, you hear what Mota Baruka say? Yeah, man. Them think they are real thing. So, you are going on, man. Like the video. <laughs> That's all I ask for. You don't know where I go there all night until 2 p.m. Well, I think around 3 or so. My time, foreign time. Is what I say. So, we're there. So, you don't know. Like the video. Share the video. You see what I say? Recommend the knowledge to somebody else. You don't know the thing. Go with there. Yeah, man. Up and running. If they can't control you, they will quote the Bible and use that to control you. Highly religious people will say things like, God told me. Well, great. He can tell me. I prayed about it. Who did you talk to? Satan will abuse the Bible and religious people will weaponize the Bible to control you. Uh, if most of the time when I look around me, I see more people who are suffer. And when I look again, it's crazy. I see some people I live okay. And when I look, I see the people who are suffer. And when we are talking about suffering, now, we are talking about by just acts of nature. You know, them, them also want to fix them water, lock up, them have a light, all of these things. But them go to church every Sunday. And most of these people live in a some volatile area where guns are to fire every night. But them go to church every Sunday. No. Some people might argue and say, I show them a wicked, why them about show all of them thing there. Why is it them a wicked? Because them about show them something there. No, there is a God according to them. If there is 
a God that demand that you have total obedience to it. Total obedience. And if you don't have total obedience, things might happen to you. That is detrimental to your survival. In other words, them say is seven billion people, maybe more upon the earth. Half of them people they don't even know nothing about this thing that is going to destroy if you don't have total obedience. And the other half might be giving lip service and trying to live in keeping in line with the orders that is given from that book that holy book so who is doing total right because even according to them the man who come who is without sin all him to get killed and them kill him hang him up and the mafia beg father father why you deserve me let this cup move from me He never what happened to him happen according to them. But them give credence to that death, that, that killing. People praise it and say, yes, good and dead for me and dead for you and dead for everybody. But the earth and the people upon the earth since that time until now, them thinking get worse. Them thinking get worse and they are more evil. The man heart get more evil. Even the people who believe in that story. We just play something a while ago. Worse evil people tend to be religious people. And the others who claim now say them not religious, but them believe in a, the Almighty God. And them same one in a majority. But when them house, when, when rain come, it a leak, fire come burn on them house. Them don't have nowhere, them don't have no family, or them have family, but the family are look about themselves. Sometimes the family better off than them. What is it? What is it that is in our mind that tells us that we have to depend on this thing, this something out there, or else we are doomed? What is it? Who told us? Who let us decide that? I start to believe, say, is we are decided. How come all of us come up with that idea? In the Western world, yeah, I must have to emphasize in the Western world. Because not everywhere in the world people believe this thing. Not everywhere in the world, people believe say, there is something out there that is deciding what will happen to you if you do certain things and what will happen to you if you don't do certain things. We give it over to this being, this something that none of us know about. We all come back, come hear about it. And people who get mesmerized and get involved in a, some personal superstition, accept it as a reality. And it's not no reality, it's fear to my work with. It's not a reality. It's fear to my work with. And it make the fear overcome him or her so much that 
when something bad happen, them say, well, God know where I do. That's why that happened. If something good happen, them say, boy, give thanks to God. Something bad, them say, God know where I do. Oh, after almost hundreds of years, cause us to get involved with such delusion, craziness in our head that it can't come out. And every time we start to shift, we put something where we are shift from inside of that thing and make it become our, what we call truth. When we really are truly, it's not we, are, it's not we as individuals decide that truth. That truth was decided for us before we were born. Before we were born, that truth exists. And we were taught, sometimes forced, sometimes ridiculed, if we don't believe in it. Ridiculed. We we'll get them forces a charm. The mother said you got good school, you said you got church and all that stuff there. Why are we going to this man in this area? I said, what are they? Why are we going to I'm going to church Monday. And I can tell you that it's 60 years I never went to that church. 60 years. Yes. As a matter of fact, I was christened in that church. My mother took me to that church, and I remember the white man, the father, who hold me and put him finger up and forehead, and he kissed me and give me a name that is different from the name of my mother and my father give me. And I sit down in the church. I think I did it for about two and a half, three hours. I look on the building. Look on the, the, the motifs on the wall. And know him say, this building was built in the name of something that no one in the church no one in the church know that something, but them believe through faith that something is there. And them build a physical monument, the biggest church in the Caribbean, I was told from my other child. Them build that monument in the name of that thing. If you go all over the world, you see bigger ones than that. Notre Dame. I mean, they build big buildings. Some men love to build buildings in the name of something. Or someone. And then idolize that something or someone. Then build it. Some people, like the man them in Afghanistan, the Taliban them, are the Muslim them, you can't draw them prophet. You can't paint them prophet. You can't make a sculpture of them prophet. Them see it as sacrilege. As a matter of fact, they will put you up to death for that. And don't feel no way like them do something wrong. And we always start to say, what a wicked man. You mean say kill the man, shoot the man, paint a picture. And Mohammed. Or imagine I'm dead or Allah's the and paint it. He's wicked. And the man who I killed the man in the name of that thing we call Allah. 
them no know nothing about nothing about it. More than them have it in them head. And have it as a fate. F-A-I-T-H is a fate. It has nothing to do with the reality of human beings on earth. And mankind has all them breathe and feel, taste, smell, and think. Nothing. It is all about control. How human beings decide they're going to control other human beings. Just like how people make a dog become domesticated. Men make other men and women become pawns to their invention that them call a fate and make it become the center of our being. And we don't know how we get there, but when we get there, it's very difficult to move out because it, it takes all of you so much that them start to instill a thing named fear in the field. And that is what makes the thing become so crazy glue, like a crazy glue, you can't, you can't move now, you get stick. Because when you, when you have the man, the fear, and then you put that thing in the name fear, you know, so you become now a slave. A slave to his intentions. So it's from that we are all prisoners. Prisoners of this system that engulfs us. Because man will be the tallest building and adoring it, adoring it with all sorts of things. And then we get up every Sunday and stand on the pulpit and speak words from that little book and then control the hundreds of people who is under him because most of the time he's up there and he's down there and when he speak he's the authority for that thing that you believe in and he will supervise you and also criticize you if you ever move out of that line you have to step in line or else you'll be seen as an unfaithful person that need to be punished by the same thing that is so compassionate and so loving and kind that he would, according to them, put you in fire for a thousand years to burn because of your cruel intention against his order. Who come up with these things? Who come up with these things? Last week, I read the Virgin, and the Virgin said, I asked him, he's all right, the thing that I was. He said, Moses. It's Moses. And then he had the other people, they know what he said. So, oh, Moses, God gave Moses all of these things. And people believe it. That that thing, by some means of something, spoke to this man and make him write him a right. That thing can write the word of God. So, anything where you see there, so. Moses is just the, the, the vessel that was used to bring that message to those who want to believe. Because most people in the world don't believe that. Don't accept it, most people in the world. It might look that way because we're in the Western world. And we see most people in the Western world, the credence to that. But most people in the world don't believe that. Them to them have one million, one billion, 
Roman Catholic. Well, what to the world population in the Chakila, and most of them don't believe that. The Indian them, them have millions of religions in India. And them don't believe when most of them in the Western world believe. The majority of people right now in Europe is going to, well, as a majority, but as a top of the world, like, is now seen as East East. East East is, in, is on the rise. But guess what? A bully of people still believe say, there's something out there that is deciding what we should do and what we should not do. It's not we are deciding that you know, according to them, you know. There's something out there decide that. And even though we don't know, know if something is out there deciding that, we must have a fear factor in it that keep us in line with that something out there that man put out there is man put it out there because if there was no man that concept would not be there and if you never get in contact with that book you wouldn't have that thinking that fear because people are in other parts of the world don't have that fear because when them ask for something and them don't get it, them don't create another thing for the opposite of the thing that if you get it and call it devil. If something happened to you, car accident or something, people go and say, Why you look, you know, a God save you from broke your two foot, you know. And you broke one foot. So why would that thing make you broke one foot? And then no, I must give down because it never broke two of my foot. What kind of thinking is that? Why should I think that two people in a car crash and one dead and one escaped? And the one who escaped is God save him. Huh. And the one who dead, you start thinking in your mind, I wonder when to make him crash or start. But I suddenly mad against God when I'm crashing up and dead you know. That is what whole heap of people who call themselves Christian think. That is how them think. You walk and you book your foot, you say, Jesus Christ, my foot. That is all we think. That's all we rap. Simple things, simple things. We give over to something that we don't know about. We just hear about it since we're born. And there's no one on earth can tell me, say, them use them five senses and find out about that thing. We say no one per earth can tell me, so them use them five senses and find out about that thing. We are talking about them ear, that thing I talk to them with them ears. Them see that thing I talk to us, uh, look on them, and them look on them with them two eyes. Them smell that thing. The scent of that thing with them nose and then talk to that thing while using the other senses to experience that thing it's strange man so i sat in that church and i think by my days when i used to go there every sunday I used to live a text mail, 
six ladies off North Street. And they just had to walk across the road to go to the church. And them days there is a white father in the on the pulpit. And talk Latin. And then when my mother moved, I would go to Woodford Park. Woodford Street. We have to dress up and walk go down South Camp Road and go to church. And my mother don't go. My mother don't go. Can't can't that. She has to cook in the morning. By the time she don't cook breakfast, she has to cook the rice and peas. Peas too tough, she has to throw rusty nail in the pot. <laughs> rusty nail again, it's supposed to soft from the peas. I don't know how them get that. But our people thinking that maybe she'll get it from her grandmother. Maybe it will. Because really and truly, it's to experience the teacher. And that is how we learn things. At least I learn things to experience. That is the greatest teacher. So when I'm gonna say why well, him experience the spirit, I must believe that. I must believe that because it's experience. But if you boil it down to the nitty gritty, it's just a feeling because of where him bring up with where come up with it in life. Him come up with it. Nothing else. It's a feeling and then they put fear upon top of it and then call it a religious belief. And most of us, most of us not hear how we go and I've said this and what I've said that. That is embedded in a way. Until we're dead, that is embedded in a way. And some of us have it more than some. It's a kind of disease, but there is no pill and no medicine can cure it. You have to just go and try to know, say, it's something. And we now have to make it in folk and a craziness in our head, supernatural things in our head, our fear in our brains. Because we know right from wrong without anything else. It's human nature that humans know what is wrong and what is right. Them know. And then man set laws to keep you in line. Because that is what law is there to do. Law is there to protect the society from itself. That is what it is here for. Because human beings must abide by the law in the society that they live or else there will be confusion and as we can see there's death and death is nothing that we know about but we see it in front of it and some people relish in the idea of death yes and the Christians believe that is when you die, you're going to inherit all the things there that you were promised by the holy book. That is crazy. That is crazy. The worst evil people tend to be religious people because if they can't control you, they will quote the Bible and use that to control you. Highly religious people will say things like, God told me. Well, great. He can tell me. I prayed about it. Who did you talk to? Satan will abuse the Bible, and religious people will weaponize the Bible to control you. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Than, than, than any physical weapon, than any sword, any, any gun, any atomic weapon. Whoever controls, will not only control you, it was so but going control your people. children, and your children's children. So it was at the Council of Nicaea that the Constantine, this emperor, needed to find a way to consolidate his power because the people that he conquered in various parts of the world had different religions, different, different ideologies. 
And it was at Nicaea where he brought together these theologians, these, these scholars, if you will, to hammer out one uniform problem. And if Constantine could convince people to take Jesus as God on earth and change that he was a human being, then they could take over the control of the Catholic Church and make one. So they invited. And one of the priests was an African known as Arius. Ooh. Bishop Arius. There's a book Be called Blacks Who Died for Jesus by Mark Hyman. See your the story of Arius. Arius now gets word that Constantine knows Arius is coming to, to dispute this. Because he's saying, how are you going to tell people this? That nobody's going to believe that story. That, that immaculate conception, come on, you know, that's written on the walls of Egypt. That's a mythology. That's an analogy. You're not supposed to believe that story. That's a nice story to live by. And each and every one of us has Jesus within us, and every birth is an immaculate conception. But there was no one boy born as the son of God, the freak. Come on, you, 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 you can't. Gossie said, look, come on over here. And I say, I'm going to talk to you. He found out that he was going to be assassinated. So he fled into Europe with his followers. Arius and his followers became known as the Arians. Wouldn't Hitler have a heart attack if he knew who the real Arians were? They were a bunch of black folk. Everybody who was worshiping ISIS and dealing with mostly a comedic religious philosophy, they said, we can't do this. This is ridiculous. This reminds me, there's no man called Jesus Christ. We ain't never heard of him. Well, Jesus Christ will take Hesus, which was the, the sun god in the West, and we'll take Christos, which was the sun god in the East, and we'll put them together. We'll have a, a name. And so what did he do? A man named Apollonius of Tyana, at that time, who had studied philosophy in Kemet, was teaching. He was a healer, working miracles. He was a hero at that time. So he became the template for Jesus Christ. The first Yes, they is a copy them, copy something to bring you this individual now that most of the Western world recognize. And if you don't believe in him, may I tell you, you that believe that in him shall neither die nor perish. But it means everlasting life. No. The man says, faith is the substance of things hoped for and the evidence of things not seen. It's about things that we believe. But you have faith in a something where you hope for. But you don't, you can't see it. <laughs> uh, it's a. Uh, I know them have a, a three, a five-way thing in our way call journalism, where them say, where, why, when, what, and who. Where, why, when, what, and who. Five W. Five W. When you go up on a scene, you ask, what? Or before you say, say where? What, when, why, who? And you can get some answers out of all of them five W there. That's the beginning of investigation. And we, in the Western world, yeah, get caught. And when somebody talks on the other side, like when we are there so now, you are branded. Branded. Yes. Because you're not supposed to say these things. You know, one say me that devil incarnate. <laughs> a devil incarnate. I don't know what is that. You know, see. People say, if, 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 you, if you say there's no devil, I'm going to catch you quick. I don't believe in a devil. I don't believe in a devil. You know what I'm saying? And I know, say, 
Sometimes good people do bad things. I have a whole heap of bad man with the good things. Come in, I don't kill people, them take the money and go feed them picnic. Me and I do man up and do prostitution out there. She take the money and go feed her picnic. Because the man gone. Left her alone to struggle with four or five picnic. But I would say I'm also prostitute that terrible. You still you have a prostitute who you can't go to with no fool fool argument. Or you can't trick them. Because one thing they night for to feed them picnic and to make a better life for them. Picnic. Where some of them are going immaculate now. Can you believe that? Yes. Now that they say I'm keeping past it, immaculate. And one of them are done tap tap. I had a daughter come tell me that idea. You know, a long, long time. She must have three youth now, she said. I beg, she beg. I said, I'm picking them to school. That now them gone as university and all them really. And no father not dead there. So when you want to drop morality for her, she don't know one name so because all she know about is to make her pity them survive. In this cruel world that created by some evil men. And these evil men build big churches big big church and pick them, them build that's you can go in on sunday and sit down and pray to the invisible god yes and when i look on the 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 the, 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 God, the a keyboard I remember the keyboard and I remember why I, I wrote some poems when I was in a 18 year old, but still relevant up to this day. As a matter of fact, I might find one of plate after this other when I take a other and come power. Yo, people. Be things are going down. So, you hear what I go on there, so you know what I say? People are praying. And you don't know, long time them things are going on, you know, from what people fill up in you know, the people. You see me? We never stop praise this. You know? Yeah, man, I want them things the way you have, to, you have to know what you do. You see what I say, people? Yeah, man. So, yeah, man, like up the video. You don't know the thing, though. Mm hmm. One of them thing the people. God know. Good vibes. Monday. Daisy Jones. I tell you. So the Roman Catholic the Cathedral Church, Old Trinity Cathedral Church, them call it. That is where them did have this service. And it was about in my early teenage life, when I talk about maybe 16, 17, that I wrote this poem. We are going to play you now. And it is because of that church why this poem was written that I'm going to play you now. With music. That poem was written because of my experience with the Holy Trinity Cathedral Church. And after 60 years, I go back in there. Then we have only for renovations. And hundreds of people come out to Desi. Yes, my brethren. Uh, enough music in the church, too. Yes, and the preacher give a long ceremony. A sermon, as I said, you got a sermon. I got a sermon. Somebody's got a thing for me. Yes. 
It's just heart jerking and wrenching when you lose someone who you really love. And then, you know, say, everyone's destination is heading to the same place. Well, everyone listening is heading to the same place. Believe you me. That I know. I don't believe that. I don't believe that. I know that. There's no doubt in what I say. And I dare anyone to contradict me with that. Everyone is getting to that place. Yes, my people. God knows. So, you hear what I'm going right there. So, yeah, man. Good style. You saw me say Muta Baruka style 990. And, yeah, people, may I tell you, hear them kind of messenger. Them kind of message. Them kind of messenger are the message where we need for you to spread right across the group. Is it? Yeah, man. So, Give thanks and praises for they are, you know, all who they are with me. Same way said speed, you don't know. Muta Baruka style, is it? Yeah, man, cutting edge, man. So, like up the video, you see me? Yeah, man, one of them thing there. And them, them church, and them going to take some phone call. I can't bear it. So, I blessed him, may you be fired. He said, no, no, said Guru. I said, what? <laughs> What's the problem? If you have a job, you're settling it. If you lose your job, you suffer it. So you better look at it. This is not about the job. <laughs> right now, we need to understand this. Your tension, your stressfulness has nothing to do with the job or the work or the business situation that you're conducting. It is your inability to manage your own mind, your body, your chemistry, your energies. You're not able to manage this human mechanism. Because there is friction within, every job seems to be stressful. You just look at the world, any kind of job people are complaining they are stressful. Listen <laughs> people. See, if people are poor, they suffer poverty. You make them rich, they suffer taxes. They, if they are not educated, they suffer that. Put them to school, endless suffering. If they are not married, they suffer that. Get them married. Nah, I won't say anything. So this is not because there is something wrong with your life situation. Your inability to manage this. If you know how to manage this, I'm saying, have you invested any time as to how to manage this one? If your mind took instructions from you, would you create stress or bliss? If your mind took instructions from you, would you create stress or bliss? Definitely bliss. So obviously your mind is not taking instructions from you. People come to me like this, any number of people. Somebody comes and says, oh, my boss is horrible, I can't bear it. My wife, she's terrible. My husband is unbearable. My mother-in-law, impossible. So I say, you come, don't worry. You come with me, you stay with me. Your husband, wife, boss, mother-in-law, nobody will enter this place. I will give you a nice place to stay, good food to eat, nothing to do. You just have to be joyful, that's all. Once in a way, at random, I will check you. And you must be joyful. If you're miserable, I don't believe in feeling misery. Okay. <laughs> but you will see within 24 hours in how many ways they twist themselves if they're alone. See, if you're alone and you're miserable, obviously you're in bad company, isn't it? <laughs> Yes, 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 more than always a pretty tiny as a judge, I'm not understanding people. We just can't understand it more than any other thing I can do. More than when you come out of the church, you need to know that we need to stop calling church. More than 
uncommon nature institution. prediction the world did not end over the weekend which means a number of preachers who live like rock stars will get to continue living the good life how good here's lisa guerrero and the ice squad with a look at some who've been preaching prosperity who are living large first, first, first. they are some of the most popular tv preachers in the country <laughs> they urge the faithful followers to donate generously and in return the lord will bring them prosperity i'm not gonna be going to heaven to be broke when i get there and there's no denying some people have prospered handsomely <laughs> the pastors themselves they live like rock stars with huge mansions private jets and fancy cars. Their lifestyles are so lavish, six of them have been investigated by the U.S. Senate, like Paula White, who lives in multi-million dollar homes in New York City and Tampa, Florida. And Kremlin Dollar, he gets around in style, flying in private jets to preach around the country. He owns this mansion in an exclusive Atlanta suburb. Mr. Dollar, how do you... Not one of them would agree to an interview about their opulent lifestyle. How do you justify your million dollar mansions in your jets to all of your donors, sir. Oh, yeah. But when it comes to opulence, few religious leaders compare to Kenneth Copeland. This home outside Fort Worth, Texas. It has beautiful water views and comes complete with a boathouse. But that's not all. Copeland is an avid pilot, and here's his pride and joy a $20 million Cessna Citation jet. It's the fastest private jet money can buy. He said he needed it to better serve the Lord, and proudly did a flyby for his followers after the church bought it. But it's not just one plane. We found a fleet of planes registered to the church. And you won't catch him waiting in line at the airport because he's got his own. The Kenneth Copeland Airport, located right next to his mansion. I think Copeland is unbelievably greedy. Oli Anthony heads the Trinity Foundation, a religious watchdog group that worked closely with the Senate committee investigating Copeland and other TV preachers. Televangelism alone is at least a two and a half to three billion dollar industry, untaxed, unregulated. That's right. By law, religious groups like Copeland's are exempt from federal taxes and they don't have to report how they spend their money to anyone. Amen. Copeland's church takes in tens of millions a year through donations and selling books and DVDs to his donors. She sent them a lot of money, uh, a whole lot of money. When Christy Parker's mother died of cancer, she found diaries that showed her mother sent Copeland most of her life savings, hoping her faith and donations would cure her of her terminal disease. What do you think of Kenneth Copeland's lifestyle? Taming doesn't do it justice. Their office furniture is probably worth more than most people's houses. It makes you sick. Oh. Copeland refused our request for an interview, so we caught up with him at an event in North Carolina. Why are living such a lifestyle of luxury off of church donations? Why won't you answer our question? A hotel employee tried to prevent us from taping. Thank you. 
So how you know yourself coming like that? How you know yourself coming like that? When you see the thing personally, yeah. you know yourself. You know, yeah. No one can't take that away from me. So you see yourself, you should not take the old day and teach people that without teaching them maths, without teaching them physics, I can't tell you. One thing at a time. One thing at a time. So the whole day when you go to school, I just, I just bow yourself, you must get to it. You don't have to take the whole day. But every day, every day, every day, it's an important thing. All right, sir. I don't know about each one, sir. All right, sir. And so each one, each one, and all of your teachers, all of your learning, you don't know what chance you're being on so small. Tell you what it was, it was like that. What I want to do. I want to want to do. I 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 want to so one hour, one hour, one hour. So, so two and two are twenty-two. Mm-hmm. Okay. And, uh, and zero and zero hour. And zero. Mm. So you get one hour one to have two numbers, but zero just have one zero and zero have one number. This is zero. Because, because, because zero. Uh, yeah. Like, when you're not trusting, you can't make no support. So, one and zero, and how much? One and zero, how much? One and zero. Yeah. You can't have 10. Yeah, you see what I mean? That means it's, it's, it's a, you need to go to school, that's all. You need to go to school, that's all. Much is a very important subject. Yeah, then, so, you can use much as much as more things. So, so what about what about the Arab the Arab figure, the male Roman figure? What about Roman, Roman figure? X is one. X is one. A Roman figure. X is one. Yeah. 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 The way we bring up Roman figure for. Because 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 them say no but they wait. Yeah, them say what they ask you know and you may have X me X in a Roman is ten. Yeah. Yeah. All right. They use letters because they never understand about numbers when the African them, when the Arab them carry up as an North Africa. Them show them say you don't have to use letters for numbers. You can use letters to spell name and numbers to count money. So, so you get I is one, I I is two, I I is three. I, V is four, V is five, hmm. and so on and so on. Seriously. So I'm you now, say, you, I don't know how you bring up Roman figure in I, but you need to know much. Much that subject where you need to know. Well, I'm going to give that for a little bit of a man. I can't do that. I can't do that. You are lead by your own misunderstanding, man. That's where you are. No, 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 no. You are lead. Listen to me now. 
You can't sit down in a school and I teach a picture about themselves the whole day. I better hear that church go learn that. No, I'm not going to church and sleep, man. Okay. Call me and sit down that. Watch out. Watch out. Watch out. What, what, what is a church? A church is what? Tell me what is a church. A, a, one, a church can be a one. Can be. Church. That means it can be something else then. Yeah. So why is a born church and state? The people that take the building, the people that take the building is a church. Yeah, so if the building is a church, why you want to the church? No, you can't. But we don't know. Church is not a, a problem. It's what they might preach in at the church. Another church has a problem. It's what they might preach in at the church. Yeah, we're in a problem. So that's it. You have too much philosophy when it makes no sense, Virgin. No, man, that's a man. You have to come out and be the most, most, most forget about other things and just teach about yourself. And I'm trying to leave them to buy, you know, because leave well, them because internal, leave them internal, you know, you know. Maybe if they didn't know much, maybe if they didn't know much, they won't so you, so we should. You know, we'll find you tonight school and we'll march, man. Come, come, come and watch the mark on TV sometime and see them and reach, you know. I'm sure you know. Yeah, so them shouldn't have them think they're on TV, they're trying to just have both know yourself. No, man, everyone wants to know themselves, man. Yeah, you will have to cause crime and violence. But people that look for themselves and look for the next one and say, shit, keep working one match, you know. That means you want that. The things that you look at, one day, the self victory and anything you look to somebody else. Yeah. You don't have more, you don't have more knowledge, you don't have more calm, then. Yes, sir. Yeah, me, 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 you are saying most people forget everything else and go teach both. No, 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 you don't have to forget everything else. No, no you have to have, have yeah. turn on this for a reason. No, man, I don't have to forget everything else, man. Okay. I don't have to forget everything else, man. Okay. I don't have to forget everything else, man. Okay. I don't have to forget Why? Why is it the first topic? You know yourself? Yeah. That means you can't know everything else. When everything else comes to you, you can't. And you know, and you know yourself. You know yourself. Yeah, man. Then all you can't tell me what a man's problem. Then all me I give a man's problem, you can't solve it. Me I give a man's problem, you can't solve it. Let me say you don't know yourself. Because if you didn't know yourself, you didn't know about the man's. No, but but all you can't solve the man's problem. No, no, wait, no, hold on, hold on, hold on. Hold on. You hear what I say? Yeah. If you know yourself, according to what you say, right? The first thing you should have to do is know yourself and everything else that come normal. Know what you say? Yeah. Know yourself, but I mean, say, there are things that come easy. Yeah. All right, so you say you know yourself. But, you know, you say you know yourself. Yeah. Uh, yes, I'm the girl if a man's problem a while ago, you're done at some madness. What well, kind of madness? Mr. One and one. All right, let me let you, all right. Let me put it that way. One plus one hour. One plus one or two. Zero plus zero hour. Uh, zero. <laughs> all right, sir. Go ahead, Clark. Yeah, man. So, so what's it? We need, we, we need to put it alive, no, man. We need to have the people to use them have a, a natural collective purpose. Yeah, have them yeah. for the first time to watch out. I have to first love the tell you know. I have to first love the tell you can look someone else. So oh, why why ask about civics a while ago? Because I want to learn of your Opinion. Yeah, but when you tell about civics, what we tell you civics, my, my yeah. opinion on civics is that you learn about the runnings of your country, the government, and all this thing. And you say that not important that you teach no, no, them, them know themselves no, first. I know, I know I think that, that is not important. No, I couldn't say that neither. They said more important to know yourself first. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Okay. All right, then. When them, 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 when
you say you know yourself and if me start asking some questions, you don't know what I say. Well, I don't know everything one time, you know. I don't know everything. 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 I yeah man, step in razor style. No, 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 no. <laughs> Cutting edge, we all I forget it. How you think? How are go on with that, man? Yes. Be your things, people. Yeah. You're the reason. <laughs> yeah, so. Yeah man, make sure now like the video. You see where they are putting in the work. You see it, people. Yeah man, I want them thing, man. So, you don't know what to do. You see it, people? Cutting edge style. Mota Baruka. The great Mota Baruka. The legend. Yeah, man. Forever walk this grung. You understand? Yeah, man. You see, if I owe you $11, yeah. and I give you $1 and $1, yeah. I hope you take it as $11. <laughs> yeah? <laughs> you laugh. <laughs> you laugh. Because you tell me one and one, I live, you know. So if I yeah. owe you $1, if I owe you $11 and I give you one and one dollar, you're going to tell me, say, you're going to figure more. And so tomorrow, Saturday, no, you I left that I'm over. You think if a man owe me ten dollar, eleven dollar, and then give me take out one dollar out of your pocket and then you find the next one dollar and say, see the one and one I left. You don't know what I said. 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 That means that, that means then, uh, you don't know and, yourself. And, that means you don't know yourself. Yeah, yeah, no, and then you say one plus one. Hour. No, because yeah. I, want, I want to figure if a something means say wrong or something your head above a different way. And, so what may I say to you now? Usually when somebody says it, it, it's just natural when I want to say one and one, a two, two and two or four. When you're a little bit me, I don't know yourself. You say one and one and say them. Be smart. You try to be smart when you say that. But when you're a little bit, I don't know yourself. You know, yeah. Go and talk to you. Yeah, so I say, we didn't a couple of times and, and just keep it in the same thing. You know, you don't say, I can't really use the third of you, though. Why? So much color and treatment and then I don't know them to them both. Black supremacy. Yeah. Where are you Where are black supremacy? All right. Keep them out of of the black people, black people, which is of all things that black people have and make and create both of themselves. Okay. So that they can say right now, and I'm doing my thing that I really, I really, original, natural, creative thing. So that, like, is, that is how you view black supremacy? Yeah. So how you view white supremacy? What is white supremacy? White supremacy is a rubber and thief and oil and supremacy. That is white supremacy. The rubber and thief thief and take them things from there. Okay. Yeah. Uh, and then them go like a like, and them are written in the kid. Okay. All right, and then keep, keep on doing these things yeah. in the school. That's why you don't get to the other day, with the other one, 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 with the
try up, try up, break up. Try up, 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 KMT, not GLT, not saying nothing about cutting up the land for the people in the Muta. You know, this, you care what preach about this land thing, none of them don't take it up. That one, this one must take up ganja, Marco, it said, you must have something for ganja. Three top. You saw them, man, that's me. You saw them sick Muta. And them friends and our house, man, that's the place, and I move more of the top. Three front. I'm going to have to give up the land. I'm going to have to give it up. If not, I'll go to the oil version. I'm going to have to give up the land. I'm going to have to give up the land. I'm going to have to give up the land. I'm going to have to give up the land. I'm going to have to give up the land. I'm going to have to give up the land. I'm going to have to give up the land. I'm going to have to give up the land. Yes, sir. I don't know what I'm doing. I'm going to have to give up the land. I'm going to have to give up the land. I'm going to have to give up the land. I'm going to have to give up the land. I'm going to have to give up the land. Let them put that from um, up um, iron. The one they were, the bread thing they were around and them say, I came with a captain and king. Yeah, and them won't know how to move up. And people don't get that burn out and the value of people say, yeah, all right, cut up the land, see the people they don't get it, yeah, and kill the people. Come here, you have to do, come from my side, and them people are good in the motor. What has wrong? That is a good in a motor. I already know I invest in a real estate. A real estate that I carry on. And I go on and I stop the Jamaican people. I stop them drying up. Catch a jam. Them have to get them high without PFP. And we have an Adam Big Company. We have an Adam Big Company. Maritime University. All right. And that's the case. I can't call up, you know. I can't call up, you know. You have a man where you're supposed to be educated to you and to the future. I went to the man talking about the man speaking mockery in Michigan. And you leave them talking. And I have the case of one and tell right to come from TV or the police, them where the man are farming. It's not look good and it's not this and that. When police are kicked off, poor people kill and I carry it all the way to the club. Yeah, oh, 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 so I do. Yeah. And I'm having a case and I try it out and try it out more than I can't tell them in case and I set up garden, pick it, keep it, tick it, tick it. And you can't try to worry with case and I'm afraid to send them up to die on the left because no one has to, no one has to. But really I go and I'll come to you with that. This case I go and pick years. I want to try it out the last out of four people. And I'm having six people in the house the way. Them can show what them taxes and them this is yet up to now. But more than the other the man we must mention the one thing man. Mm-hmm. They yeah. mention the one man and I'm saying more than I tell them today I've been just they be around to tell some of them man enough to suffer the consequence. And up until this firm in the people and not disclosing the name of our get investigation about them. But that we don't say. Alright. And and they're in the parliament, you know. They're in the parliament, yeah. They're in the parliament, Mota. And the prime minister, before he said something about it, he might be able to make him speak, and his wife might be able to say, she's smart, everybody. Everybody get their money for us. us. We even know who I represent us. I have yeah. to handle the kitty with no. We handle the kitty with even no. They might do not know, Mota. It's like they're not pushed down the kitty, and they set up them company. And the yeah. company, I get contract out. The people, just like it. I bet you, out of the six, the majority of them are from the ruling party. Yeah, man, I believe that too. Yeah, yeah. I believe that too, because I'm still one who time is from the people, the richest one, because I'm the richest one, the party, man. Yeah. In tandem, I'm going to tell you about that. Why? You don't know, but just play my favorite song there. No judges, there's a part of it. I don't know what you're going to do. I'm going to quit that. Did you see the video with the young lady? Got killed, did I? I didn't think. Got what? 
Yes, yes, yes. Nobody will see it, but me hear about it. But unfortunately, it's more than that. And you want to tell me that me and the girl, more than that, more than that. I'm going to tell you something more than that. But I'm not going to be there for what you're going to tell you. And I'm saying this more than that. The coast I was coming about being in the bus. What we do is true. And the blind side is true. I'm a Christian. And then the girl, whatever she had to handle. But more than that. The course that came up. You say, is that true that man who cut in speed motor? That girl would be alive. But true that man who cut them in speed motor. And I stopped when I do. All the while, for the road motor. Yeah, you see, boy, you see, we're having for what? What's that boulevard day before this? Yeah, then it's in the past. Yeah. I'm still working at least enough for a four band. But motor, I got me a telescope. Look here, where you when I'm focused on it, not doing it for the course that man then. I hope you're going to hear about one more time. Someone licked on the lady and then shook the foot up on the sidewalk and see that stuff in traffic. I mean, if there's a man who overtakes from the sidewalk and runs around and chill out. We worry about our country and we say we have killed them, man. And then say, I'm going to get big people to bed. Why are you going to go on the Madness. Why are you going to go on our country? Madness, madness. All right, we're going to play the two way out, sir. Yeah, man, I'm going to play the two way out, sir. I'm going to play the two way out, sir. Why, people, may I tell you, the struggle continues, my people. It's not pretty out there, and it's not easy out there, you understand? So, all the ones and ones them have to do is just take it easy and just go on. Just go on all a good vibration, you understand? Yeah, man. That's all me have to say, is it me? Yeah, man. And make sure you say you yeah, like the video. Is it me, my people? You don't know one of them things there. Is it me? Yeah, man. Big up on yourself, you know. Yeah, man. <laughs> you know what the thing? Yes, sir. Yeah, you can't see it on. You have to talk to people to turn to it. I want to talk about I'm going to go on. Just go on. Do it. All right. Yeah, man. Yeah, Mota. Yeah, I want to big up all the people who are listening to the program. You know, I'm from the diaspora. You know, straight back to Jamaica. Right, you know, the whole world, seven continents. Yeah, man. Me and Seth. Me and Mota. Me and Mota. Me and Mota. Me and Mota. To all the people who are listening. People in Jamaica, I want to watch them, watch this government and this opposition leader. Look on the constitution that they said they must reform. You know, Jamaica is a rewrite constitution. Constitution is a rewrite. A constitution is a thing where we govern a country, you know, the law, the laws of the country. Right? No. It's the only thing we can see of Jamaica from all of these criminality and these mafia things and all of them things we are going to Jamaica right now. Hospital where no have no, 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 no medicine, no have no scanner, no have no everything on you can react to criminal in parts of the law and we can stop the gap. And it's two hundred billion dollars. See, yeah, yeah, blessed, blessed fight. See, and it's two hundred million dollars we achieve every year. See, our tax year money. See, no, we need laws in this constitution. See, where when politicians pay for money, we can't hear the thing, prison them. See, charge them, try them, and prison them. Now, this little constitution when we see some man say them a real farmer where I want. Because I don't know if you look at it. I don't know if you get that. You get that. I want to think I know them now. Them not put it. It's like how oh, when they promote for them thing or they put it in a green at the front page and all that thing. Eh? Something like the constitution in where everybody can know. See, like the Ten Commandments. Like the Ten Commandments in the church. See? Absolutely, the Constitution is supposed to treat it, you know. Everybody knows the Constitution has a right. 
So we know that them people are now. See? So them are dealing with constitution reform. First, and so we have a republic. Yes, we want that. See? But we need laws that govern. See? Laws that one law for, for you, one law for me, one law for everybody. We don't need no, 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 the man to put them things in our, in our way where it has to suit them and it has to suit them and to have them and deal with it. See, now when you look for so much money, billions and billions of dollars, see, we could have made Jamaica use them, help the school them. See, we tell a man, you know, say, from 62, you know, come on till now, you know, see, this constitution, where the money has set, you know, no politician can go to prison, you know. See, you don't get to you to go to prison. See, and if you, if you, if you can use cartel as an example, see, you can cartel. I know them not find cartel, the, the, the mother, them say cartel, and them find a man dead. See, in a liar house, uptown, see, in a liar house, a liar will represent the prime minister at the time, you know, team, team liar, you know. See, and I know the liar there, no go, not even in a police car, much less to try and go to prison. See? And these are the things where we are trying to say. We want the constitution reform. We don't look for even the real restart. See? The petro jam thing. See? The SSL thing, them, 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 them trim that down to nothing. See? And look how them deal with the, 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 the little data, eczema. Eczema in the COVID time there. See? You see how them deal, deal with them thing there? And that's why we need a constitution where them, we can curb them people. See? Yeah. 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 So certain laws we want in the constitution, laws like this. Yeah. See? Two terms to every president of the prime minister. When a man of feel like them can be a dictator and control Jamaica with them friends and go around and them friends and children, them friends and this and them friends and that, them friends and prostitutes, them friends and ah, 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 commissioner, see, and all them things there. We need laws go who set where for a man and the police force and them giant police force, if them go out, you know, he will become commissioner. We don't want a man to choose and not go on and all them kind of things there. We need to shape up Jamaica. Jamaica can't run like this no longer. And, and when the youth them sit and know what are going on, the man them still has shaped the thing in a freedom way. See? So this constitution has been, this constitution has been very serious because people, we don't listen to them. We say we don't allow them to write this and write this freedom way after the next 62 years. Remember, most of them are not man, man, you know, the right one. See, and it's all down to me for 62 years. See, so I want to listen to know people, right? I want to look, I want to suppose to take part, see, youth and youth, all of them, see, in a constitution, I think, and take it serious. And see everything with them right. You know, read it and look, if it's proper for Jamaica, it's proper for them. Because they are right, you know, for so for them, you know. So people, Jamaica people, who want to take up this thing, PMP and GLP, because I want to grandson, you know, I want a son, I a daughter. This type of affect, you know, this coming like when you have a law, you know, your house, you know. And if you are going like your life, one of the fitness, more than one. The next bit of them get to eat you. That's nearly the only one there. I'm going to check for you when you're old. See? Because the next one is gone with you. So you have, you, have to, you have to be balanced. See? Well, that's how you want that constitution to balance. Because I do you know, you look on you. I do a US constitution still away there. See? You see them just trying to You see them trying to I'm convict him. You understand? If I give him some problem, if I have some problem, him get there. See? But Jamaica, how the cartel and them man there, as a, as a prisoner and, and ninja man and, and, and certain get to you. See? And when I have a big liar, 
indicating that the bird is counting out money to give me. I didn't request any money. I didn't give her my card to, to swipe it to get any money out of the bank. So you never get no money from her? No, I never get no money. And the camera with them show you, show you that Sarah count the money. So the judge said, what she says, she has found money to give me. But I never received any money. Oh, that's me. When I come back to England, I realized that I signed for $13,000. So you never looking at the book? So why you never looking at the no. book? No, I never looking at the book. Why? Why you never looking at the book? Why? Why you never looking at the book? Why I thought the supervisor of mine period blinded, you know. So I just trust that, 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 you know, everything was all right. Because I got, I used $10 million in that bank before. I never looked in the book. And it's to say that I made two withdrawals on that day. One from the sturdy and one from the debit. Oh, you know that get drawn from the book? I? Oh, you know that get drawn from the book? That's what they said. Okay. I make two with John that day. Now you never, you never I see that no money because they have 90 toes in the pocket. No, when I say, when them tell you that, no, when them tell you that, you never look okay. again to say no, no, get book the book. Look again. You know, that's why they, when, they, when I returned back to Jamaica, yeah. March gone. They, they just look at the book. And they two me John. I didn't make no joint. I said, show me the video tape to prove that I get that money and make that joint, and they, do, they won't show it. Oh, they never show you the, the, the video? No, I take the police beer with me, yeah. and they show me random tape. Uh, they yeah. never show the 21st of September, 2023. The time was 8.57. And it, it takes three minutes for me to withdraw, to withdraw the order of the bank. It takes from 8 to 7 till 9 o'clock. Three minutes to get the money out. I did not withdraw no money. So which part did you take now? Money. Where, 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 I where refuse reach? to show the tape. No, so where where it reach now? Now that the car is up, where, where the police say? When they show the police random tape, I tell Mrs. Budden, Mrs. Oh, um, she, that where? he showed the wrong tape and showed, he showed the right tape. Oh, you know it's the wrong tape. Well, oh, you know it's the wrong yeah. tape. Well, I, I must know, sir. Oh, 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 the you know. The wrong tape, she said, see where you put in the money there in your bag. And I never said that. I never, I never, that money in the bag was a whole tape that I give my passport, I show my passport to draw, that's probably the 19th. No, oh, you know, oh, you know all of that, oh, you know all of that, oh, you know. Oh, you know. Yeah, 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 I'm the one that, the NH, I know that, sir, because I, I know I'm 90 years old, I'm going to lose my strength. No, but it's not what you just say, that's why I'm going to ask you, so, Oh, you know, because you just say you couldn't sit, you couldn't sit properly. That's why I'm going to ask you, oh, you yeah. know, you know. But that's what the policeman said. What the policeman said? The policeman said, see you, I put them on your back. And you said, no, 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 what's up? Nothing never got Yeah, but oh, you know, say, it no, what's up? But where you have the tape in front of you, I show you, oh, you know, sound that tape there. Do, no, oh, you know, oh, you know. No, no, no transaction never go between me and them on the 21st of September. All right, so when I'm sure you is the no more The transaction is go between me and the 21st of September, 865, 857, was the thousand that I paid for the book. Now what the policeman say? The policeman say, he must show you where you are, though. Show you by the tape where you, where you put the money in the bag. They show me that I'm putting money in the bag. The police show you that, say that. Yes, 
two weeks ago i called and him called and called him and i'm i'm and i'm not getting you to you see those are the, those are the thing all i need yeah yeah it's your team to clear the team to show the video yeah, on the 21st of september 2023 at 8:57 yeah. to 9 o'clock yes yeah. well i can't get them for sure that is why i know i now get them for sure And you know that they are here. You know yeah, yeah. You there, you there in land. You get them to say they want show no or you are see. Well. So my dude got to see for me. I got me out the more relative. That's why I got the more relative. That's why I got the more relative. Well, I don't know. I don't know if the policeman that I take there. You yeah, have a number? I don't know. But I don't have his number, you know. But he's from all of a police station. Well, I don't have a number. You have to ask him name and number. Right. Well, I have his name. Well, you call him, yeah. call him. Get him number, yeah, call him and ask him. Serious thing. I've got his phone number, too. No, I'm going to say, if you call the station and ask him, they might put you on to him, and then you can just talk to him and show him, say, it's still no result. And you need him to yeah. really take it up as something. You know, yeah. you need to take it up. Oh, that's all. Mm-hmm. Well, that's the talk, so not right. But then, you know, knowing Jamaican people, oh, they, they will have to lay back and things like that, you know. It is yeah. like going to a big wall. Well, I don't know what to tell you then. I don't know what to tell you. Mm-hmm. Like, you can't start out something where you have a go on a negative note. You start out on a negative note. Because when you ask about a relative, you find something wrong about a relative. You find both the policemen know you say, if you don't know Jamaica's here. Well, yes, well, I, I, I probably agree with you on that. Yeah, you know how long I'm trying to 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 solve this thing with the bank. Yeah. It takes 30,000 and 1,000. Yeah, you said that already. Yeah, you said that already. But I try to help you by suggesting something. And you look down all the things that I try to talk about. You look down all the things. No, no, I'm not giving them. Yeah, man, I ask about relative. You say you don't know relative. Man, I ask about the policeman now. Where you should have called him and said, This is the case. I really want to resolve this thing out a long time. I see yeah. what you can do for me. See what you can do for me, you know. You well, I, 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 I should go back to that again. Maybe they, 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 the police. Yeah, it's not car police. Car police. I tell you, I got some money, but I got some money to go to the station. All right. So you have somebody to go to the station. Yes, I would have somebody who would have to go to the station yeah, and, yeah. and, you know, ask for him and, and, and give him the, the, the lowdown. Yeah, so you don't have no children. You don't have no children, Sabine. My children are in England, man. All of them. I have, I have kids in, 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 in uh, two boys in, in Jamaica. But, you know, one is a dead Christian. He's not going to bother with those things. So the other one will not. So, uh, you know, I just leave it like that. Then, Out of it. No, where is the one that dead Christian with him? He was a Christian that he don't, he don't want no responsibility. He doesn't, he, he doesn't want, not even a shot in the yard. Yeah, I am father, father. I mean, all right, all right. Well, I mean, I don't know. 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 I don't He just have one way. He, 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 he doesn't want anything to give him any moderation. Yeah. Nothing, nothing that not even shot in the yard. He doesn't want to get away from that. Okay. All right. Well, well, I'm going to tell you now. Mr. Sergeant, call the police. Okay. Well, I will call the police. I hear it. The woman said, "Call the police." Yeah, 
three-time heavyweight champion of false promises and exaggerated claims, religion. Organized religion. Serious business, people. Religion easily, easily has the best story of all time. Think about it. Religion has convinced people that there's an invisible man living in the sky who watches everything you do every minute of every day. And the invisible man has a list of 10 specific things he doesn't want you to do. And if you do any of these things, he will send you to a special place. A burning and fire and smoke and torture and anguish for you to live forever and suffer and burn and scream until the end of time. But he loves you. He loves you. money. He always needs money. He's all powerful, all present, all knowing, and all wise. Just can't handle money. Religion takes in billions and billions of dollars. They pay no taxes. Somehow they always need money. <laughs> you talk about a good oh, I may be committed a small pun. Always a small You are listening to Muta Baruka. Sister J was kind enough to allow me to put this on her page, so here is Immaculate Misconception. From motherland to foreign land, from beaded necklaces to change from africans to americans from warriors to slaves from ritual to religion from culture to christ from my shade to amen they said jesus died for our sins how can we believe that white god died to save our black skin knowing they hate us the way that they do they never worship a god they didn't believe hated us too we choose to worship their God. We worship it more than they do. Yet our ancestors suffered, their masters tortured and beat and made them bow to their knees as they later to Jesus. But we don't honor our ancestors for the blood that they shed. We sit in church crying with Christians because Jesus suffered and bled. We don't look to our history for truth. We look to their Bible instead, but it's time for truth to be spoken. Something's got to be said. Something's got to be said. It's time we tear down their lie. Something's got to be said. It's time we do more than survive. Something's got to be said for it's time you remember we're not African Americans, blacks, colors, or niggers. We're African people who strayed way too far. We're African people. We deny that we are because flowing like poison, their religion has spread, growing like cancer by our ignorance fed. We've been manipulated, lied to, deceived, and misled to the point that our ancestors' voices are dead. It's time we connect with our ancestors, disconnect their religion. Our ancestors were Africans before they were Christians. Our ancestors were Africans before they were slaves. It's time to start living and thinking the African way. In spite of what we've been taught, it's time to forget what we learned. It's time for truth to be spoken, for the truth to be heard. Something's got to be said to cause our thinking to change. Somebody's got to say something. I've got something to say. Before Adam and Eve, before Abel and Cain, Long before Noah's Ark, before the floods and the rains, before Abraham, Isaac, Moses, Joseph, and Jacob, before Samson, Delilah, Goliath, and David, before the prodigal son returned to his home, before the children of Israel for 40 years from him, before resurrection, redemption, rebirth, and religion, before Christians created chaos and division, before a biblical fairy tale was accepted as true, before the testament, all before a testament knew there was no sorrow and not set, Hetero, Gab, and Sebek. Heru, Sekhar Tehuti, Amen, Hera Tehuti, and Ma'at were the principles guiding our ancestors' lives. Not a religion whose God was hung on a prospect to die. Our ancestors listened to spirit, and by spirit were led. Not by a book changed in gold, but their Christ written in red. Our ancestors walked in and lived in a spiritual dimension found Jesus Christ understanding or that God's comprehension. By the time of Virgin named Mary gave birth to a Savior named Jesus, our ancestors had constructed the Sphinx and built the pyramids of Egypt. Their white folks stole us and sold us 
and told us surrender. They called us unworthy, called us ungodly sinners. They told us our God was a heathen and we practiced the pagan religion. Their God commanded they practice the form of cannibalism. Taking Holy Communion in remembrance of his death, they drank their God's blood. They ate their God's flesh. They arrested innocent women, put them in prison, charged them with crimes they never committed. In the name of their pagan religion, they for why so convincing when they put these women on trial, no one would defend them. These women healed those who were sick before modern medicine existed through a method of healing, which we call holistic. Yet these daughters and wives and mothers of children were unjustly tried and unjustly sentenced. And it was the Christians who preached, thou shalt not bear false witness, who falsely accused them and convicted them as witches. It was the Christians who judged them and sentenced them to die. It was Christians who tied them to stakes and burned them alive. It was Christians who said they were evil and followers of Satan. It was the Christians who murdered those women in Salem. And the same Christian who started the witch witchcraft crusades wrote the Bible they lived by his name was King James. Meaning the God of the Christians allowed his words to be written by hands washed in the blood of innocent women. And in this Bible, we trust it never acknowledges us. Not from the first word in Genesis to the last word in Revelations, does your Bible mention our people, our history, our nation. Not one chapter, one verse, not one scripture, one sentence. So how did, could their God have created Africans in his image? Because if their Bible is true, Africans never existed. The Bible says by his power, Jesus raised up the dead. The Bible says by his power, 5,000 people were fed. The Bible says by his power, Jesus turned water to wine. He healed those who were crippled, gave sight to the blind. By his power, he opened their ears and the mute may speak. But what does it say by his power? He unshackled our ancestors' feet. What does it say by his power that he set our ancestors free? We're going to explain why his power still ain't set us free. We're not free as a people because we're still believing their lies. They don't need to shackle our feet. Their religion is shackled our minds. I don't care what you believe. They believe in a God with white skin. And if it's their God that you're serving and makes no difference to them, whether we're saved or we're slaves, it really don't matter. Because in their minds, we're still serving a white man as our master. So if you believe you're a Christian, if you believe John 316, if you believe that God is your God and his death set you free, then why did your God perform miracles and be the children of Israel never even attempted to be your African people? Why did your God curse the Egyptians and take their riches away and let the Christians get wealthy some of your ancestors as slaves? If their God, who's your God, loved you so much, he died, then explain this, this to me. Tell me why your God freed the children of Israel from slavery by killing all the firstborn Egyptians. But when your ancestors were in bondage and saved by the Christians, when Christian hands locked their shackles and Christian hands held the keys, why didn't your God kill their firstborn? to set your ancestors free. And if hanging Jesus on the cross was to save you and me, who are our ancestors saving as they hung from the trees? If, if Jesus saved us by suffering and he, in hell for three days and three nights, who are our ancestors saving by suffering each day of their life? If beating Jesus with the, with the whip was to save us from sin, who are our ancestors saving as whips to open their skin? Who are our great grandmothers saving as they were raped and violated? Who are our great grandfathers saving as they were stripped and castrated? Why were our ancestors tortured? Why were our ancestors slaves? They suffered far more than Jesus, but not even themselves could they save. So how can we expect the sin of spit in our ancestors' face by serving a God who ignored them as they scream for his mercy and grace? How can we expect the sin has come Christians, our sisters and brothers, when they Snatch our African babies out the arms of our African mothers. How can we expect the sin to bow down and give praise to the God of a people who stole our language, our name, stole our culture, our heritage, our spirit, our will, then in our face shut their Bible and told us, Thou shalt not steal? How can we accept the sin as the God of our ancestors reject? They give our glory and honor and praise and respect to prostate burn as they put wraps around our ancestors' necks. How can we as their descendants believe Christianity could save us when the Christians who preached it were the ones who enslaved us? Yeah, yeah, people. So you don't know. Your man is stepping. You yeah, always I go say the stepping razor, you know, because you don't know how big of the stepping razor. But I cut in edge. You yeah, are going with the brother. Big you are going to bank with, with them. Yo, man getting money, swipe, swipe and no swiping, be things are going people. Yeah, man, if you're there with me, you see me, just like the video, you see me? Yeah, man. Listen. Greetings, man. Yeah, man. You know, so me shout to the door. Uh, yeah, I'm just a man. 
Yeah, man, I'm going to go to the And I recommend the podcast of the Merkel. Follow the Dallas for one night show. I call the name. Follow the one night show. I don't know where
God, no. Where is it? <laughs> Hold on. Who I eat any rat? You eat any rat? I don't mean, eat no rat, you know. I mean, tell you the truth, you know. God, no. Yo, the man say, Rat. You see you serious right now? A serious business, that. No, I'm on a serious business, that people got no answer. Rat <laughs> and cockroach and rice and them thing there. I wanna go on man. Jaja King now me I tell you boy people it no easy. But you don't know. Like the video, you know? Yeah man. And built. But is built reduced or removed by the passage of time? That's the question raised by our next document. <laughs> For more than 300 years, European merchants forced Africans onto slave ships and transported them across the Atlantic Ocean. And Britain played a huge part in this human trade. British ships carried around 3 million slaves to America and the Caribbean, where they worked on plantations, helping to build the wealth of the city of London. The trade made many organizations rich, and I've discovered in the archives that that includes a very surprising name. God Almighty has set before me the abolition of the slave trade. So wrote the great reformer William Wilberforce. And yet, during the 18th century, there were slaves in the Caribbean who bore branded on their chest the word society. This 1817 register of slaves in Barbados reveals that society means the honorable and reverent society 
for the propagation of the gospel in foreign parts, the missionary arm of the Church of England. And here is that society listed as owning some 400 slaves. <laughs> here then is every man, woman and child owned uh, by the society. Uh, we see that their uh, ages range uh, very considerably. Pajo is 70 years old and he's working as a domestic. It seems that uh, Ben George can be set to work as a grass gatherer even though he's only uh, 10 years old. Some slaves are still alive at a very grand age. Here's Rita, who's 90 years old. She's infirm. She's no longer working. But on the other hand, Okoa and Kwashiba, who are both 80 years old, are both still working as nurses. The documents don't reveal the conditions that some of the slaves would have endured. Trial working days in intense heat punishments such as the lash or being put in leg irons. For the slave owners, like the church, it was the profit of the plantation that mattered. These pages bear the musty smell as in the slaves. It's a complete failure. They failed to convert the numbers that they'd hoped to, partly because Christianity provides a point of resistance for slaves. How do you resist this terror when you refuse to take on their religion? They brand slaves with hot irons as a sign of ownership, and they flog them to death, and they also sell them off when they can't work anymore. So they don't treat them any better than slaves on any other plantation. That's what the historical documents suggest, that the Church of England plantation is no different to any other plantation. Documents show that for freeing its slaves, the church received nearly £9,000 a fortune at that time. We have in Britain today a history of churches, church buildings that are built on the blood and sweat and brutalization of Africans. again. And your heart will tribute to your brethren, there's the jewel. Yeah, man, we got to that more than one. Yeah, man, because the yeah, cathedral, as far as, as, as the, 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 yeah. yeah, man, very moving. You know, it's the same church that um, Sir Clement, that studio and Rhodes Church in Taylor. Me too. Yes, yes, you know. Yeah, man, you know, very heartfelt. And you know, this morning, you remember me not telling about Jimmy James. Yeah. I'm the father of the yeah. this morning, Church service may go at 11 o'clock in West Hampstead. Oh, yeah, church and service is at church. Every week in yeah. church, man. Well, I'm telling you the amount of people who have dropped out motor mm -hmm. and people who know that Jimmy was the bridge in 13th of December, he would have been there before. But I said that, you know what I mean? And come in 1964. So, what's the good, good bridge in so, I forgot because I had it he was one of the biographies that I wrote in the Jamaica in Britain book that came out in 2020, you know what I mean? One of many. Yeah. So we'll leave my people a drop out. And Tuesday, at the racist boy the Nigel Farage, a 25 year old woman, show a thing of milkshake in her face, the look it could have been happened. Yes, yes. Wow. You, you, you know it could have been acid or she could have shot him. Shoot him so she might be a few things. Yes, bodyguard, we're alone, but you know with the crowd, alone yeah. and king, yeah. and good 
If you see when somebody determined to do something, Muta, no one put their body there and present it. It's as simple as that. This is not why presidents and kings get assassinated. They are yeah. body guards and things, you know. Yeah. But you see, when somebody step up their mind, say they are going to do something, yeah. I that, you know. Yeah. She was arrested because she didn't mind. But flushing her in face, she was there. She was canvassing for the election thing, yeah. and she choked. It could have been acid. It could have been a shot. Yeah, they're not resigned. They're not resigned. Yeah, they're not resigned. 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 they are and um, them have been demonstrations in um, Birmingham there, in a day in Birmingham, some shop named International Weir, a bridge in, and two members of his family were attacked a few weeks ago, and they say that we shut down, you know what I mean? Yeah. Yes, mm -hmm. yes, yes, man, attacked by the staff and thing, you know, racist thing, and all oh, people saying that they have been protest there and saying that this business must shut down. You know what I mean? Because our money and African money that keep these Asian shops who are to be attacked at that type of thing. So that is what is going on. You know what I mean? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Dan Abbott is going to run as a Labour candidate. Not because Keir Starmer wanted him, but so much pressure come to bear on him. Yeah. But he has prevented a female Asian from running. And she has resigned from the party and yeah. several co-stands in why, the Labour why, Party. Why, why, why black her? Because she agreed on social media with some people who said that what was going on in Gaza was genocide okay. by the Israelis. Okay. Yes. Well, yes. Go and write your law. Everybody yeah, 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 man. Mm. Yes. Yes, I tried to give up what I mean. You know? So she said she cannot be a part of a party. That is racist, where here Starmer stop her because of racism, because she um, agree with people who say that what is going on in Gaza and the West Bank, you know, is, you know, turns amount to genocide, that type of thing. So this, this thing is really, really going, you know what I mean? Uh, you know? Uh, yeah, man. Really, done. really. Yes. Yeah. Yes, yes, yes. But you know, um, this this thing and uh, you know, and, uh, with the Ukraine stepping up even harder and harder because the Russians are saying, see, this for those who never believe, this is really near to the US using Ukraine to try to destroy Russia, mm -hmm. and the Russians really putting up stout resistance in terms of fighting, and them say that the more the U.S. and Britain supply them with arms, it's the more steps they can take to retaliate against the um, the U.S.C. and Britain and so, who supply the arms to Zelensky then to attack Russia and destroy Russia. Yeah. All right, yeah. we're going to move. We're going to move. Uh, all right, so keep up the good work. You know, no, say the no. wicked rip and the traitors will stop me from talk, but we are Pan African. If I remember Marcus Gale, the 84th anniversary, Monday the 10th. Where is the one from talk? 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 You say some words, somebody has stopped you from talk? No, I am saying the mm. racists yeah. and the traitors. Doing all them can to try to stop people like me and you and Cabo 
and other pan Africanists from talking, but we're not stopping from talking and educating and fighting. Okay, okay. Uh, then, uh, you know that. Why well, you know them no love fear you and me mm -hmm. and other pan Africanists talk and make me people know what I go on in you know, mm -hmm. Haiti, Congo, and so. Uh, and there was a big demonstration in the West End last Saturday too. Again, again, we are support the in the Congo. Yes, man, uh, that was clear. Full time, yes. full time yes. demonstration. Yes, yes, the full time. Uh, you know, we should you know, have the, the mobile phone and the time and the day, you know what I mean? Everywhere, the time and thing. Everywhere. Uh, yes, true, uh, true. Uh, the whole uh, world. Uh, like all right, put the good work and dig up the shit and all right. Yes, people, boy, we still there upon a journey, though. Yeah, man, all heap of things are going on, me people. So, yeah, man, like the video, you know? Yes, me people. So, there you go, you know, you saw me, I say. Cutting edge. You understand? Yeah, man. You know all the thing go. Yeah, couple of them music, the Japanese. So hopefully YouTube now block it and them thing there, is me? Yeah, man. So you don't know any of the people. Just like the video, share the video. Is me? You know all the thing go. Yeah, man. It's a good vibes. Always give thanks for seeing you here, you know. Yeah, man. So, one of them things the people catching you in our next one, isn't me? Yeah, man.